baby! What's up? Hey dear, are you peeing? Nope. Good girl. She needs a bath terribly. Why, she stinks? Look at her. Good girl. They had her down as a boy. Oh, look at you. Dirt ball. Dirt ball. You need a bath? I still don't think she can see. <laughs> oh man. Guys, we got the Cadillac here, so let's get a nice cold start. Ooh, it's hot in here. Maybe it's a hot start. Oh goodness. Ooh. And we have about a quarter tank, so we might be okay. That engine does not sound too good. tables and 30 chairs that are in the Escalade EXT fit in the Tesla. I mean, with the seats folded down, there's, there's a good amount of depth here. It's kind of hard to tell on, on camera, but I mean, I don't know. Let's, uh... Got two tables here. You got a chair at the back, two chairs along the side, one, two, three stacks of chairs. Honestly, I could probably put two more chairs right up there. And I just have two more chairs left. So, needless to say, You saw and heard it here first, folks. Everything from this truck fit right into here. Now, I do not have back seats, but it's kind of irrelevant, right? I mean, technically, two of the table, actually all three of the tables were on the back seat of that car, so you might have been able to fit one more person in there, if that, if that. So, I'm just saying, we're looking good, guys. We're looking good. This is, this is awesome. Look at that. So I do have room up front for four chairs. So I decided to, instead of stacking them so high, I get more visibility out of the back still if I move four chairs up here. So I figured why not? But that simply means I could easily fit at least 34 chairs, three folding tables, probably more chairs if I use the passenger seat. But hey, all I'm saying is these Model S's, lots of room. Granted, on the new Model S's with dual motors, you don't have this extra like box area there. So you wouldn't be able to fit these four chairs up front. So only 30 chairs in a regular Model S, or in the newer Model S's with dual motors. Yeah, this is a rear wheel drive only model, that's why. Well, that's pretty much it for today. The only thing that's left is, Chelsea forgot some rubber duckies out of work, so we might just go out to dinner and um, maybe a quick food vlog, and then it'll be over. So if, if, I, if I just ended on the food, here's the food. All right, guys, another car today. We got the BMW X3. So obviously, because we're driving a BMW, it gives me the right to drive like an app, right? I don't have, to, I don't even know why they have this, but I'm surprised. I think, oh, per blinkers do work. They actually work. That's, all right, that's impressive. But obviously, we're not gonna need those. Um, you know, obviously, the speedometer is kind of hard to read because it only goes by every 20 miles an hour because nobody looks at the speed when you're driving like a BMW. You just drive like an app, right? Yeah, she knows, she knows what's up.
thanks for watching.